in this lecture, we want to look at this typical example. Given matrix A, which is 6, 5, 2, 7, this is a 2 by 2 matrix. We want to do things here. A, find the determinant, which can be written in two ways. It's two vertical line, and then A in the middle of it. Another way to write is determinate DET, and then brackets with A inside. The first one might be easier, is like this. You do 6, 5, and then 2, 7. You see, when we try to find the determinant, we use vertical lines. For matrix, we use square brackets. Okay? So what we do is 6 times 7 minus 2 times 5. Okay, you do is like this, 6 times 7, and then you have a green one is right here, okay, minus 2 times 5, and here is the red one, huh. okay. So what we get is 42 minus 10, which is 32. Of course, 32 is not 0. All right. In general, you see, if we have a matrix like A, B, C, D, uh, this is 2 by 2, of course, down here. Then the determinant, determinant is AD down here. You may use the red one. Hmm. Okay, AD minus B times C. That's the green one. Okay. So, that's in general. So the determinant for a 2 by 2 matrix, we can calculate in this way. Now, we want to find the inverse matrix of A, or we may write A to the negative 1. Huh. How we are going to do that with a 2 by 2 matrix? It is quite easy to do. Huh. You see, A inverse equals, equals what? You first do is you switch those two elements. So 6 goes down here, 7 goes up. And then you put negative sign in front of those two. And then negative 5, negative 2. And then divide it by this 32. Okay? So 32. 32. 32. 32. Okay, that's it. Very easy. Huh? And then you know the first one, 7 over 32, you can write like that. The second one is five, negative 5 over 32. Downstairs we can reduce it. Okay, guess what? 1 over 16. If both numerator and the denominator divide it by 2. This one can also be reduced. That's 3 over 16. If both numerator and denominator divided by 2, huh? Okay, so we'll get that. 
That dude would be the inverse. Very easy, huh? Now, then in general, if A, B, C, D, that's a matrix. From here, we do is we switch A, D. So D goes up, A goes down. And then we put negative sign for both. So negative B, negative C. Okay? We don't switch, huh? We just put negative sign. And then you know AD minus BC is a determinant. So rather than AD minus BC, you may put determinant downstairs. Okay? Or you may pull all the determinant out. That's a denominator. And then write DA in this way. And BC, you keep it, but put negative sign in front of it. Okay, yeah. Please review this lecture. I'll see you next time.